Now there was a question on the uh, community, very interesting question on the community about uh, restricting the workflow status based on projects. Now this question has been asked by Vidya and uh, Vidya Mohan is asking, is there a possibility to add a status to a common workflow and restrict the status only for some chosen projects? Uh, well, yes, it can be done if you have a script runner then using script runner you can use uh, a script condition something like this issue dot project object dot key equal to proj or whatever basically you can check if the project key is this only then uh, let the user make a transition uh, so basically you can uh, go to the workflow and uh, let us say you want you don't really want users to make uh, in progress transition so you can actually add a condition here and when you add a condition of course you can uh, uh, restrict but I was thinking uh, is it really a good idea because uh, let us say if I am a user and uh, I am working on my issue usually workflows are displayed to the user I think there is a condition yes, yes, yes there is a condition to hide the workflow diagram uh, like you know that, that link view workflow link but uh, if the workflow can be viewed by anyone they can see all these statuses and uh, they can't make they can they can't reach those uh, some of those statuses so it can be a bit frustrating and confusing for the users and uh, i get your idea uh, that you want to <clears throat> maybe have a common workflow but try not to add too many too many restrictions to the common workflow uh, when you when you're re you, when you're reusing configurations and schemes in uh, in Jira, you should actually try to reuse, try to use, try to create a standard like a set of standard configurations. But uh, uh, also at the same time, don't overdo it. Uh, if there is a need to create create a separate workflow, and if it makes sense to have a separate workflow, it will and you know that it will create less confusion then then go for it go go for a different workflow altogether but in case you are sure about it and you know that what in, in case and you know that you need just one workflow and you want some further restriction you can uh, you can do that with the help of uh, script runner so that is all i wanted to talk about in this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today Thank you very much.